So then, we've installed the game on Windows, and it's all nicely running because we've put the CD crack on. Got the greatest gate, there we go. It all loads up. So then now we need to grab the game and throw it into Mac. What we're going to do now is we're going to delete that. Welcome to you in a second, mister. We're going to go to my computer, local disk, program files. If you've installed it somewhere else, it's going to be there. Computers do us at all, usually. So, the great escape. I'm going to get that, I'm going to drag it into Windows. I'm using Parallels Desktop 4 for Mac with XP, so I can just drag it onto the desktop and it goes there. But I've also done that before, and so it's on my external hard drive. But you guys have to drag it onto your desktop and put it into your Mac side. If you're running it on a Windows PC, that might mean burning it on a disk, putting it on a memory stick, you get the idea. So, once we've got our game across, I'm going to have to get something else from Windows. Might as well do it all at once, going to click hit start, run, ragged it, hit OK, and here we go, go away, cheater. So, edit, find. This is for the registry data for our game. It tells the computer what to do and where to look for it. You don't always need this, but it's a good idea to do it. I've done it with all my games and I haven't had many problems. So, find next. Usually you'll find three or four, especially if you've just opened it because it'll be in your last opened file thing. But what we need to look for is Binny Star Minister. We need to look for HQ Local Machine software. So we've got Disney Interactive, my Toy Story one, we've got all the different games there. So we're looking for Gotham Games The Great Escape. So I'll right click on that, click export. Save that as game, dot reg, hit save, and because it's got a 30 second delay, we won't see it on the desktop, unless we go like that. Ooh, there we go, so there's our game reg. Copy that into a folder. Now this folder is going to be in my works in progress folder for me, but you can have it wherever you want. So, I've made a new folder called The Great Escape. Now, my game's copied across, so... Maybe it hasn't. Oops. Anyway, so, got a game reg and copy that across into our main folder. Yeah, maybe, maybe it hasn't. So, when the game's copied across, we'll move that in there too. And then that's all we need to do on the Windows side.